Hi, this is my very first unboxing video for August and it is Glossy Box. Uh, this is the beautiful, beautiful box and this is in celebration of Pride in August. So this is so, so pretty. Normally we get these pink boxes here with just the Glossy Box on here, but this is a bit of a celebratory box. I've seen the press release and I know what's inside this box. The total value of this box this month comes to just over £58 and it contains six beauty items, five of which is makeup. Now, if you're new to Glossy Box, I'll just give you a quick lowdown about what it is, as I normally do. It is a beauty monthly subscription box. It costs £10 a box and £3.25 postage and packaging. I do have a refer a friend code for a discount off your first box, so that will be linked down below, so click on the show more and that will bring up description and everything will be down there links to glossy box links to subscribe and everything that is inside this box i will seek out and i will find out if they're full size sample size and what costs and where you can get them all and everything like that so it'll all be down there so take a look there if you're interested i have been a subscriber to glossy box over a year but it's in the last couple of months that glossy box has reached out to me and asked me if i'd be interested in receiving their pr boxes so of course i've said yes <laughs> in exchange for a review on my channel so it means I receive the glossy boxes a little bit earlier but it also means that my opinions and my thoughts and everything still remain my own so I'm not sponsored I'm not paid I'm just sent a nice glossy box <laughs> I also keep my subscription going so I do receive another glossy box every month and they go towards giveaways so if you're interested in that then take a look out over the next week or two when I'll be receiving my other glossy box for that. Before opening it I just thought I'd read out what is said on the press release it says to support with pride celebrations glossy box have teamed up with defected records glitter box to offer two lucky winners free guest lists to the official Manchester pride after party on Saturday the 25th of August alongside a collaboration with influencers Joseph Harwood and Jack Hayes and it doesn't say how you would win it I'm assuming if you subscribe in August or if you're already a subscriber maybe your name goes in like a hat which is drawn out I will try and find out and I will let you know down below but it says glossy box is, is about escapism discovery and a strong community and alongside a bold collection of products in this month's edition we feel it's a perfect celebration for pride so let's open it up and see what we got so let's open it up that's the inside a lovely heart there back down so it comes with a leaflet and in this leaflet it tells you everything about the products that are inside this box plus it also gives you a sneak peek which i'll show you in a little while and that's how it arrives oh i love this normally we get like a pink um tissue and we get a black ribbon and a little sticker but it's all multicolored as you can see Woo! I don't want anything to fall out <laughs> oh i love it i love it i'll open it up and give you a quick look i'll put it down the side of me as I normally do, I'll grab an item and I'll show you and then I'll refer back to this card. It says, express yourself with an intense cruelty-free eyeshadow from a brand who encourage diversity and self-expression. A blindingly bright highlighter and some Victoria's Secret style pampering. We promote vibrancy, love and liberty in our international glossy community. So glossies, let's celebrate. Love is love. <laughs> and there we have our sneak peek for next month, which is there. So let's start by grabbing this item oh and it's the biggest item and this is a cute little face mask so this is a sheet mask and this is party party let's pre-glam perfecting sheet mask with hyaluronic acid and it's by pink and it's cruelty free that's what that looks like there so the information says that this is by Victoria's Secrets and the recommended retail price for this is £5. It says it hugs and contours like a second skin and is formulated with hyaluronic acid to help to achieve a floral space for your makeup. Wash and dry your face, position the mask, chill out for 15 minutes, remove the mask and massage in the excess product. Ready, set, get glam and go party. I've never tried anything from Victoria's Secrets. Never. So I'm pretty chuffed to try that actually. I wonder what it'd be like. But no, I really like that. I love the design as well so nice first item ah this is our sneak peek we had this in last month's box so i knew we were getting it uh, i love this if you've never seen this before it's pronounced mina sometimes you can see it as three ina but it is it's pronounced mina and uh, it is really nice. I've done a makeup review, a first impressions makeup tutorial on this last year sometime, and I was really, really impressed with the makeup. So yeah, no, I was quite excited to try this. The shadow paint, and I've never tried anything like that before. So it's a cream eyeshadow, and it's 12 mil. So let's see what it looks like on my hand. 
Oh, I love a navy. I love a navy eyeshadow. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh. But <laughs> I've put a bit too much, I think. Oh, that's really nice. Really, really nice. But uh, no, I've just made a complete mess on my hand there. But look at my finger as well. But no, it's really nice. I like it. Feels nice as well and it's dried quite quickly. So this is a full size product and the recommended retail price for this is £8.95 and it says we are loving this midnight blue cruelty free eyeshadow from Mina, a brand who encourages self-expression through makeup. Highly pigmented, long lasting and waterproof, it's perfect whether you want a striking look or something more subtle. Apply with an angled brush to line your upper and lower lash line or apply all over your eyelid for a super bold look. I know I'm quite excited to try that see what I can do and I will be trying it out as an eyeliner actually because I do like wearing coloured eyeliners now and again so the next item we've got I'm going to make sure I don't get all blue all over it now. Trifle Cosmetics, which we've seen a couple of times in beauty subscription boxes. This is a lip and cheek jam. 78% water-based, 99% natural. It gives you a sweet, healthy, natural flush of colour that lasts for 10 amazing, hydrating hours. It says, dot two tiny dots on the apples of your cheeks and lips and blend out with your fingers. Keep it natural and nonchalant. Do not try to be too precise with the application so it looks super youthful and vibrant. So that's what the outer packaging looks like. Let me just open it up. Oh wow, it's in a nice, nice packaging, nice bottle packaging. So what's it look like here? Oh my gosh. I don't, I'm lost for words, I don't know what to say. It is, yeah, it's weird, I want to smell it. Does it smell like jam? No, no smell whatsoever. So. You can see that it reminds me very much of food colouring. Very, very subtle, very subtle. I'm not even sure if you could see on there once it's blended into my hand. You can see a slight tint on my hand there, but that big blob is in the way really, isn't it? It's quite a dramatic colour. I was like, oh, I'm not putting that on my cheeks. But um, I just literally put a tiny, tiny, tiny dab and that has blended out lovely, really, really nice. So it'd be interesting to see what it's like on top of makeup and maybe underneath makeup if it's a bit too pigmented. But um, no, I quite like that. So this is a full size item. And the recommended retail price for this is £17.50. It says, rest assured, it's natural, vegan, cruelty-free and organic too. So, no, and I've just read the back of the information about what you're supposed to do and how you're supposed to apply it. So I'm not quite chuffed with that as well. A bit different. We've had a few Trifle Cosmetics items and I don't always like them. I think the lipsticks, I think I'm not that keen on. They, I can't remember. They're more like um, concealers than lipsticks for me, but I do like that. We'll see, we'll see anyway. So the next item is a pen. And oh yeah, this is the Ink Me pen. It's a tattoo pen. So this is by Rimmel. And you might have seen my lovely YouTuber friend, Michelle Lightning Lass. She wears a little stamp on her eye there. And she loves these. She's, well, she's been wearing them since I've known her really over the last year or so. And yeah, she always wears it. So I know she's gonna be super chuffed when she sees this in the box, definitely. And I wonder if it's the actual one she gets, I'm not sure. So this is a stamp tattoo so it's a facial stamp tattoo but I suppose you could put it anywhere on your body I have never done this before I'm gonna put it on what side should I do I don't know I don't know I feel a bit nervous it's only a stamp <laughs> and it's a heart okay should I just do it here <laughs> that is so cute oh ooh, that is so cute I'm not sure yeah, I suppose it's all right. I'm sure it looks where Michelle puts hers. <laughs> that is so, so cute. I love it. So the information says that this is by Rimmel London. It's a full-size product. And the recommended retail price is £4.99. Celebrate love with this heart stamp. The intense matte black ink dries instantly so you won't be late for the party. It even fits into your clutch bag so you and your besties can have fun on the way or at the party too. So I know that's quite a fun product to add, I think, in a beauty box. <laughs> so next item is a Kaleido Cosmetics, is that how you say it? Kaleido Cosmetics, and it's an Astrolite highlighter. I've never heard of this brand before. That's what the outer packaging looks like. That is a really nice colour, really nice. I'll just take the wrapping off alone. And it looks beautiful. Oh, it's like a little sponge applicator. I'll just put it on my hand. It is like a rose gold. It's really pretty. So it's a highlighter, hopefully you can see it there, shimmering on my hand, there. 
really, really nice. I'd be more likely to use that as an eyeshadow. Um, I'm not sure what it'd be like as a highlighter. It is quite dramatic, but I suppose considering this is a celebration box, you know, it's a festival type box and yeah, so I think as glittery and standing out as much as possible is the way to go, isn't it? But no, actually I've just blended that in now and it's quite nice. It's quite subtle. So I suppose you just add on, you just add on as much as you want really and just blend, but I think that would be quite nice on the cheekbones there <laughs> uh, or as an eyeshadow I think it's really pretty so the information says that this is a full size item and the recommended retail price for this is £13 be as subtle or vibrant as you fancy with this illuminating 8 hour highlighter from the fun and fearless Kaleida Cosmetics we love that it's 100% cruelty free vegan friendly and smells gorgeous too it smells like Play-Doh <laughs> oh no it doesn't Oh, it smells like sweets. Oh, I don't know what it like fruity sweets. Oh, ooh, I didn't notice that. Okay, it says dab on the high points of your face using a beauty blender or brush. For more natural illumination, mix a few dabs with your foundation. Glossies, let's gleam and glow. <laughs> so no, quite happy with that as well. Something a bit different. And these are stencils. So these are by Rimmel London and they're Ink Me stencils. So I've seen these in shops. I've never ever bought them. And I've never been anywhere actually where I would wear them. But um, no, it's quite funky. They're quite nice, aren't they? So I can imagine applying it to your face or on your body, somewhere on your wrists. Oh yeah, and your wrists as bracelets going at my arm. That'd be really pretty, wouldn't it? Oh, I would have done that. If I had this before I went on holiday, I probably would have done that just to see what it's like. But no, for a festival and things, I think this is fab, isn't it? Although I'm not going anywhere. This is a full size item by Rimmel London and the recommended retail price for this is £4.99. They're waterproof and last up to four days simply remove the clear sheet and press the decorated side onto your skin hold a wet cloth on top for 30 seconds before slowly peeling back the paper so now so those are all the items so i'm just going to gather them all up these are the items the six in this month's glossy box there's usually five items in a glossy box so yeah so they've added six which is good they all come to us as I said at beginning around 58 pound and the cost of the box would cost you 13 pound 25 now there's some items that i wouldn't necessarily go out and buy myself like the face stamp and the stickers but I think that for fun value and because it's a themed box I think it goes well and it's quite yeah it's quite exciting isn't it I was quite excited to try this little stamp on my face because I've never done it before the face mask is great I can't wait to try this eyeshadow as well as this highlighter and lip tint as well I think it's really good I think there's some really nice items in this month so yeah so what are your thoughts do you think this pride edition is a really lovely box this month or do you think that no it's a load of pants <laughs> I'd love to hear your thoughts as always and if you like this unboxing it'd be lovely if you gave me a big thumbs up and if you'd like to see more and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already so thanks for watching guys and I'll speak to you soon take care bye bye